Ah, finally, Dragon Ball is fixed! Remember when you were watching it as a kid and you were constantly bothered by how it didn't have any non-binary characters? I'm sure you lost a lot of nights being unable to sleep because of it! You just couldn't enjoy the hair color swaps and the Kamehamehas because there weren't enough troons in it! Well, not anymore, and now you can sleep at night knowing Daima fixed this series overlook by making the Kaioshins non-binary. It corrected the wrong social positions and it's now on the right side of history. It is an important move to finally have queer representation and shows why Toriyama had grown socially conscious as Daima became more and more popular. In just five episodes, it's now as popular as run of the mill isekai that nobody watches. And that is how Daima grew up with us finally and is now mature. It's for adults! Just don't go asking why some Kaioshin look like women and have big boobs, although they don't need them since they are born out of a tree. What you should be asking instead is why did Toriyama take so long to add so much needed representation? Thankfully, he didn't forget to have Piccolo, who is clearly black, on Namek, which is clearly Africa, fighting Frieza, who is clearly the white slaver. Now shave your head, swear never to have sex again, and demand even more queer representation in Daima! That is what we need more of!